I'm Mike Mizek with the local news. Today I'm here at the Pittsburgh Irish Festival. Queen Elizabeth has just died. Let's see what's on people's minds. And uh, who am I speaking with? Uh, my name is Patrick. I'm Sean. Patrick and Sean, those are very Irish names, right? Would you say those are Irish names? <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> it's spelled the right way. Yeah. Uh, so uh, how Irish are you guys? Do you, I see you're wearing kilts. Hold on, let me get your outfits. I got your outfits. Well, one kilt and one non-kilt. Uh, so this is so that you consider your you guys consider yourselves like Irish guys. That's about so. Yeah, oh, sorry. Irish works for me. Yeah, I'm either Irish or uh, full blood or half blood. So. <laughs> uh, so what does it mean to you at a festival like this? Is this is this is this like you're feeling in your element or what? I mean, it's it's nice to be here and uh, be surrounded by the culture and just you know, be surrounded by what you were born into. Yeah, what you're familiar with? I like drinking. I like people. I like people drinking. So <laughs> honestly, this is just a vibe. <laughs> and the music, what do you guys, do you have a favorite of the music for tonight? Oh, shit. Who was, did we see first? Us. Uh, my favorite, Screaming Orphans. I don't know who was up there. Uh, Wild Geese. Wild Geese, yeah, yeah. I like them, yeah. Wild Geese. Do you guys have any particularly strong feelings about recent happenings in the UK? Uh... A queen dying wise no comment <laughs> no comment it's a shame for the English but great for everyone else I suppose uh, could you care to elaborate on that no <laughs> <laughs> okay so do you guys families come over the potato famine or uh, other otherwise do you know I mean today I just learned I'm black Irish which is the Spanish Settling in Irish and uh, intermingling, I guess. Yeah. Uh, I don't really have any of that connection. I'm kind of. Yeah, you guys can go deep. How deep? You guys know your clans? Some people I've talked to like know their clans and stuff. Oh, yeah, I got the uh, Sullivan Tartan on right now. Made uh, sure I got the right one. We're all set up. Okay, so that's a clan specific Tartan. That's very cool. Nah, man, I'm adopted as shit. Uh, adopted as shit. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah. No, I mean, I. Yeah, I've just found out I had a clan. I didn't. I, I thought I was Italian. I mean, I am Italian, but it's the Dunphy clan. Dunphy clan. I think it's south, 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 south. Uh, um. So okay, no other thoughts on the royals. What about Northern Ireland? What are your thoughts on Irish unification? I don't know enough to comment, sorry. Okay. <laughs> no comment. <laughs> also no also no comment. You 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 seem like you've got some feelings about this, but is it because we're in enemy is it because we're in enemy territory? I don't want to push too hard here, but blink twice is if it's because we're in enemy territory for uh, I don't know who's around, so <laughs> <laughs> you're right. <laughs> I didn't hear the question, I'm sorry. Oh um 
uh, as far as uh, Irish uh, unification of the the entire island. Irish independence. Yeah. You can get them out of Britain. Fuck it. Okay. All right. I've been waiting for someone to say that. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> um, any thoughts on, uh, like, American politics? Any thoughts on Joe Biden or Donald Trump? Don't like Trump. Don't like Biden either. Both parties are bad in their own ways. We just need to work on making the middle ground less of a fucking bog fest, really. <laughs> That's Any thoughts on uh, Dr. Oz? Kind of fucking spastic. <laughs> as terrible as that may sound, holy shit. No. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. Just get him the fuck out. No. You guys think he's from Pennsylvania? Like, no, no I mean that in a xenophobic way. Obviously, a Turkish American can run. But what about... Isn't he from New Jersey? Yeah. I, I've heard he's from New Jersey. No fucking idea. I, I don't care. Honestly, all I've like, oh, not all I've seen, but a lot of shit I see is just shit talking of like shitting on him. So I'm just like, I'm just, I don't like him, but I'm also not gonna believe everything I see. Yeah, you know what? No, the uh, the misinformation he spreads on like homeopathic bullshit, uh, that ain't cool. That's one thing I'll say. I, I'm not down with him. You don't believe in the power of uh, raspberry uh, ketones? No, fucking... <laughs> man, no antioxidants are going to cure your cancer. That's It, it ain't it. Uh, any thoughts on John Fetterman? Not a one. Sorry. Not familiar? No, I'm not sorry. <laughs> not familiar about John Fetterman? Okay. Look... He was mayor right over there, right over there, but that's okay. Mayor? He was mayor of Braddock. He's running. He's running for senator against Dr. Oz right now. Well, what's he for? Uh, he's a big union guy, uh, Medicare for all guy. I mean, he's. Some people have said he's similar to Bernie, but he's definitely got his own brand to him. Uh, but yeah, I, I, I would say. I mean. Pro union in the way that he will, will go to a picket line and you know not just say he's pro union but show up to the actions and such. What do you think about that? If he's for the working man, then sure. But a lot of people like just say that just to get their image out there. I basically have the same. If he's genuinely with us, then I'm with him. But if not, then he stands alone, I guess. Any other general thoughts about uh, our world at large? Uh, fuck Russia. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you're not a fan of their incursion into the Ukraine? Oh, absolutely not, but... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's that's a whole other thing. I'm just ready to die. <laughs> oh, uh, does anything give you hope? Currently. Um, uh, hold on. Maybe. Is there a glimmer? Puppies. Maybe. Puppies. Ish. <laughs> I'll take it. I mean, medicinal cannabis is becoming more and more popular, so... <laughs> That'll fix it. Hey. That's that? It well, could fix, help with a lot of things. Look, I... So I completely agree with that, and as well as other pharmaceuticals that are controversial, like uh, psilocybin and all that, I fully agree with us testing and seeing how it could help people. So. Ketam uh, ketamine treatment for depression? Oh, yeah. Uh, ketamine could help so many things as well as, like, depression, bipolar, all of those. It is an incredibly beneficial program that I think it should get the funding and um, support it needs.
That was a sample of a Patreon video for the local news. If you'd like to see the full video, go to patreon.com slash thelocalnewspgh.